everyone, Glamma here. Welcome back to Glam It Up with Glamma. Today I am going to be teaching you how to achieve a really quick, fast, super easy bun on the go. You can do this in like five minutes and under. When you get really good, you can probably do it in two minutes, maybe even less. Um, but yeah, it's super easy and I think it looks super classy and it's so easy to do if you have hair that you haven't washed in a couple days and you just don't have time to wash it because you have an appointment that you have to get to really fast this is a super easy updo that you can do so alrighty guys um, like I said it's been requested a lot every time I wear it I uh, get people saying I've got bun envy how'd you do that and believe it or not super super easy so stay tuned if you want to see how I got this bun in under, actually I think I did it in like under two or three minutes. Alrighty guys, so what you'll be needing is a hairbrush and bobby pins. I don't use bobby pins all the time, but you can use bobby pins and you'll be needing a hair donut that you can buy at like Walgreens, Walmart, Kmart, wherever, Target, um, or you can make your own like I've done. The one I have in my hair right now is the store-bought one, so I can't show that to you, but I'll show it to you when I show you the steps of how to achieve the look. Meanwhile, um, you can make your own out of a sock. If you have black hair, you can use a black sock like this. See, I made my own donut. <laughs> so yeah, and if you have brown hair, get a dark brown sock. If you have blonde hair, get a tan sock. And yeah, all you do is cut the toe off, roll it up, and you've got yourself a homemade hair bun donut, yay! <laughs> All right, if you want yours even bigger, get a couple socks, um, put them inside of each other, and then cut the toe off, and then roll it up, and it'll be a little thicker, and it'll make your bun a little bigger. All right, so if you're interested in how I got this look, then just keep watching. Okay, so let's get started. I'm gonna get started with my donut that I bought at Walmart. This is what it looks like. They come in different colors depending on your hair color. They have black, brown, and I believe like a tan color if you're blonde. So first of all, just brush your hair and make sure that you have all the tangles out. And then once you've done that, just start making a ponytail. I'm going to leave these little hairs hanging down just because I like them like that. So you can make your ponytail as high or as low as you would like it. It's kind of hard to do this on camera and stay in shot, so pardon me guys if you don't get to see everything. All right, so that's probably good enough, at least for now. Gonna get my hair pretty. I call it a hair pretty, hair elastic, whatever. Um, everyone has different names for it, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. And just make yourself a ponytail. Okay. And now, if your ponytail's not as high as you would like, you can just kind of bring it forward a little bit, adjust it as you go. And I like a little bit of poof right here, so I'm gonna poof it out a little bit. Okay, so I think we're good. Now, get your hair bun donut and just open it up like this and put it around your ponytail and bring your ponytail through there. Yours will probably be easier if your hair is not as long as mine. Mine goes all the way past my butt. So <laughs> now what you're going to do is you're going to bring your donut up all the way to the tips of your hair as so. Okay and then separate your hair in the middle like this okay and tuck the ends in as much as you can okay 
it's a work in progress. So I'm gonna lift mine back up, but now you have an idea what I'm doing. I'm just tucking like this. So I'm gonna lift it up so that there's not a big old poof right here. And I'm just gonna keep on tucking and tucking and tucking. Till you get down to the bottom. And there you go, until it's down flat on your head. And then once it's down here, you can just adjust it to however you want. You can make it, you can pull out hairs if you want, if you want a, a messier bun, or if you want a neater bun, you can just leave it as so. But yeah, super easy and quick. I love it. And as you can see, it's already secure. It's not going anywhere because you've wrapped it so tightly, but if you want to really secure it and or maybe you're going out or you're going dancing or something and you know you're going to be moving around a lot then you can take your bobby pins and you can just secure it further it'll grab your hair it'll grab the donut and it'll get close to your scalp as well so that it stays nice and secure so yeah, just go ahead and do that all the way around if that's what you want to do, okay? And usually I don't do that. Usually I just leave it without any bobby pins whatsoever. So that is it. I hope you can see it. Let me see if I can turn around so you can see the back of it. I hope the back looks okay because I obviously haven't looked at it. Hope I'm in the shot. <laughs> Alrighty guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and no matter if you're just going to a picnic, um, just going to the store, um, going out um, for the evening to a nice dinner or to a party, I think this is good for casual or for like an updo type look. So I think this look can be worn in so many different ways and it's so quick and easy. So I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you try it, how, how it worked for you. Every time that I happen to wear a high bun like this, I've gotten comments like, oh, I have bun envy. How did you do that? Can you make a tutorial? So I finally did. I been meaning to do it for about four months now so finally the tutorial is up and it's super super easy it can be done in like five minutes and under once you get really practiced up it can be done even quicker than that probably two minutes <laughs> maybe quicker <laughs> all right there's another way to use this donut I'll save that for another tutorial and there's another hair bun little um, tool that I want to get that I believe is supposed to be even easier so, all right, guys, don't forget how much I love you. Don't forget to love yourselves and everyone you come in contact with. All right, guys, I love you. Bye. Mwah.